Hi guys, we are demonstrating the Coolpad Cool UI on the newly launched smartphone Days X7. Coolpad, like Geonin, Xiaomi, is a Chinese smartphone player with its own custom UI layer based on Android mobile operating system. Cool UI is what they call it. It's based on a similar idea compared to MIUI and Amigo with no app drawers and the home screen all along for the application as well as widgets. Although the Cool UI provides an option to switch back to the traditional looks with the app drawer and the menu button just in case someone prefers it. The icons and overall color scheme has been kept different to make it unique from the other two. Although it rolls down to the same idea, it do features an application called Themes which support themes compare as which is there on other two as well. And also a uh, customary app cleaner which will have the applications fetch in the RAM. It, it, it has a rock wallpaper application to change the colors of uh, wallpaper with a single tap. And then there is another concept of app grouping that has been instructed in an application called Sort Out, which sorts the application based on the category as per its own artificial knowledge. The but what we would really like is a solarized or a dark theme for the system UI, overall system UI, just like Juni has implemented in, in its latest update to Amigo. And uh, also the cool part, the X7 has is a dual SIM handset, so the overall operating system has been designed to uh, make the dual SIM switching as easy as possible. The camera app on the Dazen X uh, on the cool UI is minimalistic with basic functions um, visible to the user and a lot of other things too, which has been kept abstract for the users to explore. The recent menu on the cool UI has been developed. Uh, a whole lot different from the other two with the app screen along with the RAM consumption and notification toggles on the same view. The on screen button uh, in the cool UI has been designed to accommodate maximum screen space with hiding them and making a review for more view things. The overall the UI is good but we would explore probably sometime later with the Android Lollipop update. Thank you.